Welcome to EJH British Cars. Today we're going to do the B post repair. We're going to fabricate a patch and we're going to weld it in. So let's get started. So here's the bottom of the B pillar. This is where the sill goes in, the rail. And you can see this is all lacy. It's a little bit more solid here. And in the back, the, this flange is missing. And of course, the last half inch is missing on this whole thing. So I went ahead and bent up a piece for it. This is this. So this little notch here is the hardest part. That's that notch there that you have to. You can't do these in the brake because they're too close together, or at least on my brake. I suppose if you had a V brake, you probably could, but I don't have one of those. Um, so you know you can put your first bend in with the brake, but after that I'm using the vise. And then I have a piece of quarter inch plate steel so I can put it in the vise with a little bit sticking up, slide the plate seal underneath, use that to leverage. Uh, anyway, so that's going to go in there. I've marked the line here where this is, I'm going to cut this off. And then I'm going to weld some tabs in to stabilize this and I'll show you that when we get there. So here this is trimmed off. And then I made up this plate that's going to go on the inside here, and that little flange is going to make up for the bit that's missing from here for the sill to push against, and then I'm going to spot weld that in. And I'm also going to put another straight plate there, and probably one more here, spot welded, and then this new piece will go over them, be spot welded also. And that way there, A, it gives me good alignment on the post because these are, you know, this is stable. It's all where it should be. So that'll line this up with that. And I'll have a lot more surface area to join this because every time the door shuts, opens and closes here, you know, it's trying to do that to the post. So I'm going to get the spot welder and we'll spot weld this. So there are my three alignment plates in. Spot welded in. The spot welder just barely fits in there. I had to change back to the short tongs. And we're ready to fit the piece. So I've just got it tacked in, but you can see you get pretty good alignment right here. Maybe just tuck that bottom in just the tiniest little bit. So there it is all in place, spot welded in, all three sides. And then it's getting late in the day, but tomorrow when I have the uh, MIG welder out, I'll go around just uh, do this butt joint and I'll make it that much stronger. Um, maybe belt and suspenders, but what the heck. And that's the, uh, the three pieces inside. You can see it's nice and tight on there. And here we go. Before and after. Quite the difference, eh? So I hope you enjoyed that. I think the next one I'll do the A post. So I'll probably make you a little bit of video on that because that has a different shape. So don't forget to like, subscribe, join, and share, and we'll see you next time.